that was I'm still like hype over that. Is that <laughs> break dance? Yo. Yeah. Just the fact that it, it happened. Like it just happened out of nowhere. Dubai is full of everyone, firsts. Everyone, stop, stop, stop. <laughs> So, uh, and the, and the thing too, everybody actually paid attention yeah. to him and cheered him on. In the U.S., everybody be like, "What the heck is happening?" And they'd like walk away. Get up! <laughs> <laughs> so, I like it. I've been saying the people in Dubai are great. Everybody's polite. Everybody's hospitable. Everybody's respectful. I mean, that was just another example. I of mean, it. you're a guest, so we should. You know, we, we're a community. We help each other out. Make, we, uh, make each other comfortable. All right, and the stage has been selected. Three, two, one, go. Okay, so it seems as a fun check now. Uh, right. I mean, we I talked like that last, last time, time but she. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but this is obviously fun check, you know. He's uh, totally going to throw bombs on stage. All right. So this will be interesting. Um, I don't think I've ever seen this matchup happen. Nor have I, actually. Yeah. Uh. But it's basically a war zone, no pun intended. Lots of yeah. lots of things. Yeah, lots shooting. of zoning. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So uh, we're gonna be seeing a lot of um, trades between bombs, pellets, um, possibly metal blades. Uh, what, what what is that called? Uh, the crash bomb. The yeah. side B from Mega Man. I call them stickies. <laughs> stickies. <laughs> I mean, that's just kind of the same thing. But here we go. First game on FD. And already, uh, all the the lemons getting them yeah. in there. All the lemons. Yeah, but from from the first interaction, we can just see that this will be a projectile war. Yeah. Yeah. TNT uh, throwing those saw blades back. Yo, and lemons. Snack is fighting back. Those those pellets. Have, for some reason, they got great shield pressure. Yeah. I don't know what's about them that makes it great, but they just do. No, I mean, they're, they're, they're jabs. It's just like anybody's jab, except they go, you know, a few feet in front of him instead. Yeah, so <laughs> make him more safe. Yeah. Uh, just shield poking, yep. Yeah, it's... Okay. Oh, it just comes nice. with raw with the down air. You don't see that option uh, used by Mega Man a lot. Okay, lots of spot dodging. Yeah. Uh, sorry, rolls. Like it. Liking the patient shown. Oh. Got that blade. Close. Yeah. What's he gonna do with it? Yeah, TNT oh. has to be careful of committing to a unsafe uh, option because Megalith got that for Yuki. Right. So he borrowed it from his friend Ryu. And that's gonna be yeah. one of his best yeah. kill moves. And oh, but don't that forget back air the back is gonna air. do it yeah. too. That back air is ridiculous as well. Snack with a stop lead. I get now, from my experience, if you're playing against a zoning character and they have the stop lead, it's really hard to get it and yeah. come back. Because all they do is basically stay back and throw lemons and metal blades. Yep, get as much damage as he possibly can. Uh, force you to have to come at him when uh, if you do take that stock. Not sure why he got hit by the boomerang there. Yeah. But TNT is doing a great job of forcing air dodges oh, not capitalizing on them Ooh. but that is a great confirm that oh and we got the eyes kill Mega Man pretty heavy character I think I, th I think it's one Ooh, of the heaviest that I'm not sure. yeah no the high out of that one yeah uh, just a small 20% yeah, still can anybody make game. it back with a few boomerangs to the face bombs yeah what's uh what we saw in that last stock is uh the Mega Man jab does not stop to link bombs so he can't really just get reckless with running forward and shooting them when uh when two link has a bomb drawn that's right great combo by the by uh tnt just closing up the percentage gap but snack says Ooh, no I'm, I'm gonna keep it far away oh and catches right back oh i like that option he looks like they're over here playing ultimate frisbee <laughs> But Snack covering a lot of options using the metal blade. He Z dropped the metal blade into back air. Very good by Snack. Oh, and we stuck. Oh, he got the sticky. Now TNT off stage. Bad position. All right, makes it back on. What's it gonna be? Oh, nice blade. Yeah. 
It looks like uh, Snack really doesn't even care if he's getting hit by these bombs. Yeah, it looks like it. I mean, maybe he's trying to capitalize on rage or something. Oh, or maybe he just he doesn't put it in his mind like, oh, okay, I need to stop. Like, yeah, yeah he just wants to get in. Oh, oh man, misses the back air. So tried deep. to close it out. Oh, the down air. Is either player's game still? Last oh, knock. God. Both players with rage. This is intense. Oof. Oh, Kimmich still grabbed that. Ooh, and the back air's gonna option. do it. That was so insane. Whew. So close. It, it it didn't seem it seemed like Snack was in control of that whole match. But again, when we go back to it, he was at over a hundred percent, and uh, you know. Two Link did have a lot of rage, so that could have gone in the opposite direction. But it was hard to notice just by the way he was playing the neutral. It seemed like he was dominating. Honestly, I thought TNT was more dominant. Did you? Yeah, huh. that's what I thought. But to my surprise, it's the opposite. <laughs> yeah. Well, if if at the very least, you, if you just want to look at percents, you know, TNT was never had a percent lead the entire game. That is true. Right now, TNT. But now he does. And beats the landing. I like the shield pressure. One of the things I noticed about um, TNT yesterday is his shield pressure is insane. Like, he, he would uh, drop bomb into up air. And, you know, you can't move. It's so hard to catch this guy. Oof. Almost got the spike. Yep. Yeah, but spe so. when I'm um, speaking about the shield pressure, I don't see it much coming from uh, TNT in this matchup. Yeah, I'm not sure if it's because Snack is. Well, Snack actually up. isn't using his shield that much. So. Yeah, he's keeping. <laughs> yeah, I, I think that's why. Oh, a little too short on the forward air. Okay. And a little too low on the back air. Yeah, that up air has a long-lasting hitbox. It is ridiculous how long it lasts. Yeah, that, nice was, that was a little too obvious. Yeah. That's for an unsafe dash oh. attack. No DI. Yeah. Okay. Right. Immediately off yeah. smash. Just doesn't want to get yeah. hit by a, a thousand up tilts again. Okay. The aloe vera. <laughs> TNT off stage. Oh my gosh, he's oh, so far wow. away. Still makes it back. And TNT keeps switching out for these outsmashes. Um, I'm not sure that's the best thing. I mean, maybe he's trying to capitalize on Snack's landing, but I think playing it safe is much better, like throwing out bombs and Ooh, right. and there's that uppercut. And that's what I meant by uh, outsmashing is not that great. Yeah, if he, if he would have just done like what you said, used his projectiles a little bit more, he might have gotten a bit more percent. Not bad, though, 53. Yeah. And he's slowly building it up, so... Ooh. Oh, that was scary by Snap. Oh, he tried to yeah. spike. But TNT is smarter than that. Tries to stick him. Miss. I think um, TNT has gone on a grab, a single grab in this whole set. Did he? I, not that I can remember. Yeah, because uh, Tunic actually has, I think, the second strongest factor in the game, if not third. Yeah, but that the startup of his grab, obviously yeah, one exactly. of the worst. Exactly. But, but still, I mean, the risk reward. But against Mega Man, I can understand why he won't do it because he just punished you with an up, uh, up tilt. Yeah. So you can oh, that was I never seen that combo. So here, here is we're seeing the reverse TNT with the life lead, but that means Snack has more yeah, rage, rage, and he can end this with a well placed back air. Yeah. Ooh, Possibly stuck. a ledge trunk back air. Boom! Oh, tries to connect with the four there, but the sticky bomb coming in. Oh, oh, and that's it. <laughs> that I back throw, I like I said. It. The grab to back though. TNT took the second game. Yep. Now we're going to game three. Are we gonna see FD again? He's doing stage bands. I'm. I i do not know. I think. 
Maybe Snack would go to, I want to say, Town and City. I mean, it has a lower ceiling, so. And I'm kind of. What? I'll just go smash it. Yeah, because we're not really seeing him attempt to, to get any kills off the top. He did one up air that entire in the entire first two games. Yeah. So, <laughs> TNT. We, yeah, we go, we're going to Smashville. Most neutral stage, if I'm not honest. Oof. But these trades are too hard. And we see this we see this situation many times during the set is where oh TNT would have the uh, the lead, Snack would just make it back. Yep. Make it back. Somehow, some way. He just goes in yeah, you know, without even I don't think he thinks when he goes in. Yeah. Yeah, you know, because usually like, you know, you would try to shield, you try to uh, like avoid jump by jumping and stuff. Yo, scientist runs it. He goes head first into the bombs, boomerangs. But it's number one. It's it is getting closer. Yeah, it's and the he has he the to be in. He has the percentage lead now. Yep. And it it's gotta disorient TNT at least a little bit because I'm sure yeah. most opponents, uh, you know, they do what they can to avoid the bombs and that moves them into positions where they can get hit by his aerials and his tilts. But Snack is running through the bombs. He's not. He's not ready at for that to be spaced that way. Now TNT at his last talk of his Pow. winner's bracket life. Ooh. Okay, nice combo. Snack actually ranked number one in the UA rankings. So, Ooh. so losing to TNT would be kind of an upset. And I'm sure it would be frustrating for Snack as well. Yeah. Oh, he, he went in. Yeah, he's trying to he's trying to close this out. He's trying to send one for the highlight reels. Yeah. He's trying to get on EMG highlight reel. <laughs> uh, hey. Oh, nice combos. Okay. Slowly building up the percentage. Oh, and that's that was a nice. Like I said. Fifty nine, not terrible. Yeah. Comeback still possible. And this basically turned into the war attrition. Yeah. yeah. If he can, uh, if Snack can keep his percent under probably like 90, then this is probably. Oh, oh, oh my god. Oh gosh. my god. <laughs> this could be an impact for him if he can keep his stocks under 90 and he doesn't get gimped like we almost saw yeah. just then. Yeah, that must have sent a huge statement to Snack. Yeah, he's probably scared now. You know, he wants to play it safe and not commit to something like that and uh, we call the situation but right now TNT they put it up opposite okay TNT makes it back safely Ooh. tries to go for another back here I'll smash oh wow just bombs everywhere yeah they're both missing each other yeah. snack taking a couple bombs okay TNT slowly bringing it back yeah. Okay. That that percent starting to get up now. Seventy seven. Oh wow! What was that? Oh. Mistimed it. Whoa! Did you see that? Yes. Okay. TNT oh no! Has to pause throw the oh the no! Way. It's so close now. That has to be an input error by Snack. And the oh, back throw Lord. does oh, not kill. Lord. But that Snack does. Goes in and <laughs> gets the kill. TNT sent to the losers back. And consoling. Uh, TNT. He's like, dude, that was so close. You did great. Sportsmanship. And how <laughs> he's happy about this next one. Now, so congratulations on Snack for defending um, his country. <laughs> yeah, because, you know, he's, he's basically the number one right He came player. in and said, yeah, we must protect this house. Must protect. <laughs> the house will not go down. Oh, so we're speaking yeah, of this Snack. Is this no. is his Bowser plushie. I don't know where he got it, but I love it. <laughs> Just gonna chill with this guy here. Do -do 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 okay. Do -do -do -do. So who do we have next on screen? Hold that thought. Okay, here we go. This is a hype match. 
We have Madonna. We all, we all know Madonna from watching the stream. Great. Second best player in the Middle East, I think. Best player in Kuwait. Um, yeah, so he's a, he's a scary opponent. <laughs> yeah, and yeah. next to him is my boy, the number one ranked player in Qatar. Uh oh. Magnu. Don't be biased. I'm not, I'm not gonna be biased. <laughs> Commentators can't be biased. No, no, I'm not, I'm not gonna be biased, okay? Because I hate him. I hate Nagnu. <laughs> I hate Nagnu, but I love Ahmed. <laughs> okay. Alright. Is it because he plays Fox, okay? He plays Fox, like. He's an honest man. <laughs> Say that one more time. He's not, Fox is not honest. <laughs> what do you mean, man? I don't know. <laughs> Okay, no hating, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, we're gonna be seeing Sheik versus Fox, or possibly actually. Nagnut has a bunch of ca other characters. Uh, he mainly plays Fox now, but we could see Falcon, Cloud, or Dark Pit. Huh. Honestly, if I were. I say just go with the Fox. Yeah, Fox would be his safest bet, but honestly, I would think. Darkman would do well. No, no, no. I guess maybe he's having the same Robin. internal struggle. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I was like, I thought he, yeah, <laughs> I thought he was actually gonna go Robin. <laughs> he's struggling.